What when is... I was a kid, I used to wonder about Massasoit, and one of the things I wondered was why would he welcome the English? Why would he be so kind to them? Because everybody said that you know he was such a humanitarian that he felt sorry for the pilgrims, so they gave him corn and all this stuff. You know, that's a big self-serving American myth. It's just justifying the, their the presence here, legitimizing the taking over of territory by saying the natives welcomed them. The native people that made an alliance with Plymouth Colony, Massasoit's people, Pokanawket of the Wampanoag Nation, they made it basically because why would they want to have two enemies? The Narragansetts, whom they could probably consider to be their biggest threat, or these gnat-like English people that kept coming around the country, but they never seemed to stay before. Now all of a sudden they got a group of them that's building houses that have brought their families, women, first time English women have been in New England. Native logic would say, well, you don't bring your women where you're gonna make war. So let's make peace with these people, use them as allies. They got their strange weapons. If we make peace with them first before anybody else does, then we'll have them on our side and we won't have to face their guns. To me, that's the logic of it.